hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to view completed tasks here in microsoft planner let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in microsoft planner i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Viewing completed tasks here in Microsoft Planner is a simple process that could help you manage projects and track progress effectively. So once you are logged into your account, I want you to hover to the left side panel of your dashboard and click on My Plans. That is going to be the access to your hub planner. And from here, just choose the plan that you wanted to view with the completed tasks. For example, this one right here. You see, if the progress hasn't started yet, all right and you choose to make them completed right here completed all of them and you choose the board section so you notice that you're gonna not gonna be able to view them here already here in microsoft planner so for you to be able to view the completed task all you're gonna do is group by bucket you see you might want to click on the progress and you would notice that this is going to be the completed right here all right so these are going to be the completed options you can go to the filter progress and section completed so these are going to be the ways for you to be able to view the completed tasks here in microsoft planner because reviewing the completed tasks right here as you can see they have a strike through it's let you access how much progress has been made in a project or plan of course it helps you understand how close you are to completing key milestones by seeing completed tasks like this one you can recognize accomplishments and celebrate the completion of critical deliverables within your team this is particularly important if you are working with multiple freelancers or if you're working with uh, clients because by viewing the completed tasks you can assess how work was distributed among team members and whether the workload was balanced you can also look for tasks that longer than expected or needed more resources, helping identify potential process inefficiencies or bottlenecks for future projects. All right? Because as we all know, viewing completed tasks is very important for maintaining a record of all tasks that were completed throughout all the projects. And this could be useful for audits or post-project reviews. And I believe that Completed tasks like this one serves as a record of who completed what and where promoting accountability among team members. All right. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next one.